New at 5, the wife of a 76-year-old Columbus man accused of molesting a 10-year-old neighbor wants him freed tonight. Police say the elderly suspect put cash in the little girl's underwear. ABC 6's Lisa Rontula joining us now live with what he had to say from jail. Lisa? We were there when he called his wife of 43 years, asking her to bail him out of the Franklin County Jail. She tells me he made a mistake. She feels betrayed, but in the end, she told me he is a good man. The wife of 76-year-old Marcus Polk could only watch as her husband faced a judge in his very first criminal case. He looked like a little shriveled up man. But after hearing the charges that he molested the neighborhood girl who they would often feed and clothe. He was great. He loved, he loved kids. And also heard he kissed the 10-year-old in the couple's home and shoved money in her underwear. <laughs> Betty Polk heard from her husband, who was calling from the Franklin County Jail. Where am I supposed to get six thousand dollars from? Have you let that sink in a little bit? No. Could I make me with that? For putting our lives in jeopardy. While living across the street from the school and less than a block from the park, police say Polk admitted to molesting the ten-year-old twice this summer. I said, well, why? And he said, I don't know. He said, I really can't tell you why. I don't know. Betty pleads that her husband made a mistake and is not a threat. He is not a child molester. He's not a pedophile and he's not a bad person. She says all she wants is to have him back home. He could be put on probation, a house arrest or something, and let him come home so I can take care of him. We were unable to reach the parents of the victims in this case, excuse me, one victim in this case for comment. Reporting live from the Franklin County Jail, Lisa Rontley, BC6 News.